Well, one of the Browns' coaching positions uh, appears to be filled. Actually, another. Uh, you know, the tight ends coach, Tommy Reese. Mary Kay tweets out, Browns are going to hire Deuce Staley um, to be their running back coach and uh, replace Stump Mitchell. Um, also, some news relative to the roster. Browns are signing Luf Lucas Haversick, who was on their practice squad and then signed by the Rams to the active roster. He's back on a futures contract, so in essence, uh, practice squad kind of guy. Um, so, t Tim, again, the, the kicker, he didn't have a lot of success in the playoffs. They kind of moved away from him, but young guy with some talent and, and Deuce Staley. Yeah, I, I think with Deuce, you know, even looking at his profile, I mean, he's been around the league a long time. You know, people like even my age probably remember him, you know, having a productive career with the Eagles, closing out with the Super Bowl with the Steelers. And then even looking at his coaching profile, profile he's been working with running backs a long time, you know, for about like 10 or 11 years, he's been a, a running backs coach for the Eagles a long time. Then the Lions and 21 and 22 really kind of laying out that, fa that foundation with Dan Campbell. And really, I think that was all that I think, the Browns seem like they got a good fit there. A guy who knows how to kind of, you know, work together, run a game without a number one guy. And I think that might be something interesting going forward is, you know, is the run game going to kind of be more similar to this year where they kind of have to do it by committee as opposed to having one, that number one guy, Nick Chubb. And I know Nick Chubb should be back at some time in 2024, but you always wonder how long it will take, you know, after significant surgery like Chubb had to kind of get back to the form he had, or if you're going to have, or if you're going to draft another guy to kind of groom him as the next number one guy, or if you're going to sign somebody, it's a lot of different ways the Browns could go. But I think getting a veteran guy in Deuce Staley who you know, has obviously coached the position a long time, a fresh voice, you know, after after Stump Mitchell did some good things the last four seasons, just a fresh voice in there. I think you can't go wrong, and especially with an experienced voice like Staley.